Hola amigos, I'm the Spanish chef Omar Rally Boy and today I'm going to show you how to prepare a tomato salad with nectarines, some manchego cheese and basil and with different techniques as well, some which you may choose to use in other recipes like the basil oil and the basil puree that we're going to be spreading on the bottom and that will bring this salad to a whole another level and I think you are going to enjoy it. But without further ado, let me run you through the ingredients. We're going to need a nectarine, some tomatoes, manchego cheese, salt and pepper, sherry vinegar, extra virgin olive oil, some Spanish Iberico ham, caster sugar, garlic, Dijon mustard, fresh basil and a bit of milk. We're going to start by blanching in boiling water the basil for about 30 seconds and we're going to drain it off the water using a colander and cooling it down straight away in some cold running water, some ice water. Give it a good squeeze to make sure it releases all of the water that it has absorbed and that it's very very dry and we're going to blend it in a power blender or a jack blender with the extra virgin olive oil for a couple of minutes until it has become a very thin green puree. Just use your spatula to catch the sides if needs be as sometimes these small amounts don't work very well in all uh, jack blenders. Strained the puree, uh, the basil puree from the oil using a, a thin mesh or a, a, a chinois as I'm, I'm using at the minute and make a little bit of pressure with the spatula to make sure that you maximize the amount of oil that you take and that you are left only with the basil puree itself and reserve both. Now we're going to start preparing the garnish. So in a jug or in a glass in my case put some garlic, the sugar, mustard, salt and milk. Add a teaspoon of sherry vinegar and the basil puree. Add your basil oil as well and as you see it will all split. Basically the solids and the milk will stay in the bottom and the green oil will stay on top. Bring your hand blender all the way to the bottom and start blending and a little at a time start raising that hand blender so that it absorbs um, oil in a very gradual manner uh, so that it emulsifies and brings some air. It's the easiest way of making mayonnaise, aliolis or in this case this basil dressing. If it is too thick to your liking you can always add a little bit of water and make it a little bit runnier. Uh, there is a bit too much for this recipe so make sure that you use what remains of the green oil as well as the dressing um, for another of your recipes. Now discard from the tomatoes the hard end that attaches them to the vine and cut them into rough sized pieces. I'm using a collection of heritage tomatoes that I found in the supermarket but just use any tomatoes that you have and cut your nectarine in half and cut it into wedges. This recipe works really well with peaches as well by the way and some other fruits you could see it working very well with melon for example or even oranges and as you can see I'm just keeping that remaining oil in a squeezy bottle because I will be using it for future salads too. Now cut some rings of the red onion which by the way was an ingredient that I forgot to mention at the beginning and now start spreading the dressing on the bottom of the plate as if it was a bed. So instead of creating a more liquidish type of vinaigrette or dressing that you would uh, use for dressing over the salad or tossing your ingredients in the salad in a bowl, we are using it to spread it on the bottom. It has a way better look, it's a little different and uh, you can use it for many different purposes. Now scatter your tomatoes, your nectarines, a little bit of your red onion, the Spanish ham and we're gonna finish it off with the basil oil to, to finish it, a bit of maldon salt and the thinly grated manchego cheese over the top that always blends so well with salads. Familia, I hope you enjoy the recipe. Remember, you have it on my website, thespanishchef.com. Please like it, subscribe and all the lot and it's dinner time for me. See you on my next video. Adios.
Delicious. If you enjoy the video, please like it, share it, and subscribe.